All right, let's take one half divided by 10. Here's how you do it. So it's helpful if we take this 10 here, and instead of 10, let's call it 10 over one. Because 10 divided by one, it's still 10, but now everything lines up real nice. Next, I'm gonna take the reciprocal of 10 over one. So I'm gonna move the 10 to the bottom, the one to the top. That way I can say one half, instead of division, times the reciprocal of 10 over one, which we said is one over 10 or one tenth. And then with fractions, when you multiply fractions, you multiply the numerators, one times one, that's one. And then we multiply the denominators, two times 10, that's 20. So one half divided by 10 or one half times one tenth, that's one twentieth. And that kind of makes sense because we have one half, it's a small number. We're trying to see how many times 10, this whole number, fits into this small number here. We should end up with an even smaller number, which we do. This is Dr. B doing one half divided by 10. Thanks for watching.